Jesus Reigns TV. Colonizing, dominating, and impacting nations with the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ. A men anointed by God for such a time as this, proclaiming the decrees of heaven and announcing the seasons of God among man. A men aligned with the calendar of heaven. A prophet with an attitude of a servant, a father with a heart of son, a voice of prophecy in this generation. God bless you, family. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord make his face shine upon your life. Uh, family, I want to make this announcement. Before the year of 2023, which is going to become a very important year for the nation of Zimbabwe, the Lord has asked me to gather many of you and many of those that are Zimbabweans for prayer. Now the Lord has continuously asked me about this for the past year now. I tried to send a message to some Zimbabweans that are very significant that there is a need to keep on praying at least once a week before the year 2023 in the nation of Zimbabwe. I said the most important thing about the nation of Zimbabwe as it stands, it is not about who will win and who will lose, but the most important thing to pray for in Zimbabwe right now, it is to pray for righteousness justice to be established and I said this is so so important in the eyes of the Lord that righteousness and justice be the focus of the nation now family I don't know those who are in Harare Zimbabwe or those who are in South Africa Johannesburg I don't know specifically when we shall have this meeting or when we shall have this gathering. But the Spirit of the Lord has prompted me that before the year of 2023, we need to gather as intercessors and pray for the nation of Zimbabwe. So I want to call on you, everyone who wants to be part of this significant gathering, Maybe you are in Johannesburg, maybe you are in Harare, Zimbabwe, and you know how this plan can go about. I want you to conduct our ministry and conduct our team and tell us what you think about what God is saying and how what can be done. But the Lord has asked me to gather intercessors on what we shall call Choose Zimbabwe Conference. It's going to be Choose Zimbabwe Prophetic Conference that will be very, very significant. As the Lord says, a prophetic word cannot be spoken unless an atmosphere has been created in order for that prophetic word to prevail. So in that conference, I'll simply be praying together with you and joining you. So those who say maybe we should have it in Harare, Zimbabwe. That is still fine. I'm ready to come to Harare, Zimbabwe before the year of 2023 for this significant Choose Zimbabwe conference. And if those who are saying no, it's rather better we have it in South Africa, Johannesburg. I'm ready to have it in South Africa, Johannesburg. I want to call upon you. You have a plan you know how all this can go about and the Lord has touched you in a significant way for you to be part of this. I want you to conduct our ministry. You might be a minister of God. Say, man of God, I want to collaborate with you. I'm a Zimbabwean or I love Zimbabwe. I want to make this possible so that we can have this gathering called Heal or Pray or Choose Zimbabwe. I believe that God will do significant thing. The Bible says, love your neighbor as you love yourself. 
and I believe that God loves Zimbabwe and the best is yet to come for the nation of Zimbabwe. God bless you. Thank you for your prayers. Thank you for your support and thank you for subscribing and following Jesus Reigns TV. The best is yet to come for you. God bless you. Shalom. God's servant Yamkala Joseph has been released by God in the year of 2020 to publicly prophesy and speak to the nations of the world. Since then we have seen many prophetic fulfillment and events foretold before they happen in a very accurate and powerful way. If this generation is to believe, they should know that Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today and forever.